traditional phase run and gun get down and they get dirty they make that gamble to the c site but the next set they recognize because they send one player to just default towards the c site they know this site is open Ooh. but zachary okay two quick shots on the right click classic and things are starting to fall apart here for x set Zachary just chilling in that position along. Nobody heard him at all. Now it's only one player remaining. It's Aaron that just tried to take that control two of heaven. Good nade too. That's gonna lead back Ooh. Marv. To, ooh, that satchel. Nade. There you go. He's got a nade. Even more damage. He gets back a nade, but the defuse is gonna go down. Corey wins it out for phase, but more specifically, full one of that. Only one or two players actually upgrading their pistols. So phase need to maintain this clean. Oh, Corey. Corey for one, just going for the eco frags. There you go. Easy farm. Thwaifo takes one back over towards the market side. And ooh, okay, Zachary said that he was going to take things a little bit cleaner, but he actually just wants to maintain at least some attention. Gets that information. Not only that, but a kill in the back line. x going to be able to get a plant, so that's a little bit extra cash, but the Shock Dart lineup, almost huge to deny the spike plant, but a little bit of an ulti is going to get boosted up. Watch out. The Empress is still online, but Zachary takes one back onto Thwaifo. The drop in. Oh, man. Zachary actually kills himself there, but it's all good. Pure is still alive, but Baby Bay low goes for the frag. Rock is trying to drop. We did get it back. 1v two and it's all oh it's all on bcj but Corey takes them back that's a whole lot of damage though for an eco yeah x said they get super aggressive in those post plants pure kind of right in front of that a connect that cloud over towards long it's still gonna be fought up by pure the old orb oh. is gonna get taken back but they're still fighting long my god, Corey gonna be able to get another one. Corey takes a third. Aaron takes one back, but it is what it is. Now Thwaifa remaining in a 1v3. It was hard not to mention the battle for the old orb. So many players holding crossfire. So if he can isolate the 1v1s, he can stand a chance. And you might have the first on a silver platter. Thwaifo, good info. And now I'm using the neural theft to get even more from it. Good stuff from Thwaifo sets up actually both cyber cages. Nothing else for him to use. He's got to bounce. Indeed, he's away. The paranoia oh, gonna miss. Oh. Gonna be able to get the kill onto Marved. Now this man can play some time. Zachary now in a 1v1. Look at the strike. But the waifu, the hero for X. Oh, the showstopper doesn't get any damage. But with Aaron making the space, the spike will be able to go down. Hunter's Whoa. Fury, though, he's got to move. This is going to buy so much time here for FaZe to get back into the site. And Whoa. oh, baby, 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 huge double kill off the Blade Storm. And next thing you know, it's just one man. He was going to try and play off the Hunter's Fury, but the spike never went down. One versus four. They need back-to-back -back clutches to get two rounds on the board here. And BCJ, he's good Whoa. with the gun, but he's not going to. It's unbelievable that I, I, that Xed did not take up that B site, but it is what it is. Now Thwaifo has full control of this site. What? At what detriment? 25 seconds left. He has a cam up for the information. Nobody knows that it's here, so he can really can, can play some time here. But it's another close. Still coming off that play. Oh, that. Oh no! Not again. It. But he's exploding. Thwaifo could be able to get one. Still one low in HP. He's playing around perfectly in terms of spacing. Spike is still around him, still searching no for the way. frag. No could way! No way! able to get one. A gust of wind could take down Zachary, but Zachary with a sidearm takes down Thwaifo. More aggressive here. They're looking for blood, and they might just get something. But Aaron doesn't nine at least the first. Oh, good stuff too. That linger over in mid, still catching off another. Has to come down to Zachary, another person to market to try to crossfire. But Rock is a smoked off. And the satchel combo alongside a hedge. Again, good usage of the showstopper. It's just a threat of it. Just being oh, around what? it. I, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I was about to say, ah, it's gonna empty pressure, right? But he ends up getting two off of it. Baby Bay with a quick draft. He's gonna end up getting one back, but pure with a good 2k. And that's just gonna be it for the round, isn't it? 1v4. It's a tall task, but again, real chaotic near the end of things, but that one was quick. Aggression shown whatsoever. It's a complete retake of this A site. Yeah, usually you would have Zachary run that heaven area, and not only that, but that TP could have ended up getting shut down, but instead we did TP into plant exits. They have full control, but they're still going to maintain a lot of pressure, actually, over in the back entrance of the A site. 
There's one person trying to make his way in. Thwaipo is still going to end up getting that kill. And not only that, but the Neural Theft. That's so big for Thwaipo. As now the info is wide open for them. Phase, they're splitting up. They're actually going to put one over towards the Heaven side. Two in Paranoia through. That's actually big. Just to at least make up the space. Zachary on the front lines. He's actually he going for the defuse. Off the smoke long. But... With a stick, he goes down BCJ with a double, and we did cleans it up. Exit. Nation, it's do or die, and we're live. It's already taken to market. It's Thwaifo around the corner. Okay, what an explosive start. There you go. Straight back into it. An exit. The heat hasn't left just yet. Three rounds in a row to end off the second. As good as it gets for them. But now it's going to have to be a retake. You commit so much into Garage. But then you've got a Paranoia. It's more running and gunning straight across. But the spike, it won't go down. And it hasn't gone down just yet. The boom bot still... Marved around the corner, gonna be able to take down one. Rockus gets traded back by BCJ. Phase the A site should be theirs here momentarily as BCJ in the back. A flying baby bay goes down, but there are still more phase players approaching, and BCJ has dealt with a second now. And it's just a cleanup at the very end. Left. He's gotta get going now. Oh, baby bay on the front lines. Great, How is he not dead? There you go. Okay. Amazing paranoia. Delayed so much time, but even then, Aaron takes him down. And he's still sitting up. Corey and Rockus with a good crossfire. Still covering up their options, but it's There's still going lurk. to be BCJ in the back line. But Zachary, he's there. Taking down Thwaifo, but now last person remaining over towards market. Zachary just getting pressured out. Has to get that spike some way, somehow. But the pressure out from the shock darts just delaying time. Pure takes down Zachary. But that one, Sully, there was a haul. Oh. oh, Pure oh. needs to get this, but good movement from Baby Bay. Again, very much expected from the jet mains, but again, no tracking there from Pyrrha. Couldn't get it back, but oh, Baby no. Bay still sitting around the smoke. Oh, no. Dashing out, taking down We Did. Huge clearance by Baby Bay. The sole job of a duelist is to make space, and Baby Bay takes it on his own. Paranoia, but it's going to completely miss here, Sully. We Did in the back line. Couple double to Aaron. The dash in. Aaron with two. Could potentially find another. And not only that, but BCJ still cleans up. Somehow Pure was alive that entire time. Again, this conversion is just going to be too difficult. It's fun to call it out in theory, right? But yeah. they really have to couple up everything that they've got. They have a whole lot of ultis, but one of them end up going down the blade storm down long. It's done and dusted. Still have that same position. Marv trying to fight. He needs to win this battle. He's going to continue to fight as a frag goes back. But the Stinger comes around in perfect range. Corey takes one back with the Guardian too. It's on a reel that you called it, Sully. But they need the conversion. And they're starting to get it. Nades going in. A whole lot of damage. Gotta feel bad for Zachary. He's low. Incredibly in terms of HP. The shock darts aren't hitting. And that spike is all the way on the open. The Hunter's Fury back, though, for the attacking side of phase. Just clearing out as much space as possible. Trying to get a kill, but can't find anything. 4v2. This is so difficult to punish. There are three players, or two players more or less, completely low. Great swing! What, what? a sh- Aaron! What? Wide swing with a blast back. Now gets the showstopper. Can't find the final kill. Onto the player out towards long. BCJ's got to isolate these 1v1s. He's got shock darts, but he's got no time. They have no it's idea. down to Marv. One versus two. The sheriff in his hand, and it's running on around. BCJ's head is gone, but Aaron's got the round just barely. General, Aaron, it's a little bit unfortunate that he was the one to actually get the kill in that fashion, but going into this round, super quick, super simple. It's completely unexpected, but it's the phase mindset. Hold dub, have fun, use util. And now they're out of there already. 4v2, and they already have the spike plant. It's deja vu. Yep, there's the old phase run. An exit with the numbers advantage, with the utility that they've got. And we did committing a really, really risky TP. I was about to say, let's go back to heaven. And a paranoia still available is the biggest thing. You've got Aaron on a flank, and phase are all congested into the middle of this A site now. Uh, okay, a little bit slow. From Aaron actually taking his time, making his way in. But this is a massive battle as Corey somehow still alive. The Empress of Darkness looming in the shadows. Still not able to get another one. The chaotic battle. I was mentioning how Aaron was. It was just to draw attention away, right? Reset no, the round. Let them know that there could be a player on your backside. And they end up. Getting confused, I guess, FaZe. You weren't prepared for what was to come. And now Exit, this is a little confusing because they're going straight down mid. ECJ, 
It will be spotted out here. There is nothing to punish, and it's still weed in this corner. A win's good for one on the trade, and we did can't be punished Ooh. until Corey takes the swing, and he does indeed. Exit down to three, but the wife was trading things <laughs> back here. This round is anything but cohesive. Phase. They make the TV back to the A site to try and switch the tempo up, and it's exit now. Who will be on a retake here as Mart's gonna try and keep players from getting into this site now. As it will be phase. Who could get an 11th here, but Xset with a showstopper on Aaron is going to be the biggest thing here. FaZe have always had good post plans, and this is where they really need to shine. Oh, Shock Dart's coming in too. Zachary's not going to get hit, but instead it's actually the cam that stayed in for the retake. Zachary. Oh, he's setting up a post plan. But he's ended up going away. You know, this is beautiful. Sends up the post plant, not only that, but the dart in. Gonna be able to get a little bit of information big from Aaron just to make that space, but still two over towards shorts. Good eye, but Thwaifo still gets one back. 1v3 for Marved. Gotta come up huge, but can't get any of them. BCJ shuts it down or rank. And FaZe, they might not be prepared for this one. Oh, pure needed that one, but the running frenzy. We're on a different patch, folks. 2.02, it still helps out. But the classic, the right clicks, they never change, do they? Zachary with a 2K up close. That's going to leave X sets at a man disadvantage. BCJ. They're still there. Still around like we mentioned, but the hard flank from earlier. It's coming in clean over towards bathroom. But BCJ, he needs to bait out attention right here, right now. Aaron does get a kill back onto Zachary. Make it a second. Now last person remaining over towards the UL area. The need is massive. Kobe coming in from Aaron. Here clear he clears up the A site all by himself. An X set round phase. They never cease to entertain super fast up towards B. They actually split this one out. Marv going to be able to get one back onto Pure, but Aaron with the trade back. Still Baby Bay taking up the control, but you still have BCJ back at elbow trying to escape. Six HP. No bullets are going to hit him. He somehow survives. He has a little bit of util to try to help out, but we did try to make his way through the cage. There's nobody actually watching the exit from it. We did with a little bit of timing. Could have been able to make his way out, but BCJ still there for the trade back. Rock as the information is fully on him. The TP goes back. Back. He's barely gonna have enough time to make his way on and get this plant mm -hmm. And not only that, but I would have said that there's still util still laying around Yes, the tripwire is in u-haul, but it's a little bit different of a scenario I love that cyber cage though the double cyber cages where rock is he is feeling the pressure once again another TP We're going around the world. This dude is running and running He's got to make that commit, right? Because Recon Bolt goes in, those double Cypher Cages. He ticks the Cypher Cage, which is even more unfortunate. So they know his positioning, but this is winnable here. Raucous, 1v2, takes the first Wipo. Great instant trade as Xset. They do knock up a second round, but look at those casualties. There's going to be no bonus going into this one. In phase, they can... Over towards short, but Baby Bay now on through. Off the cloud! Oh! oh the right click on the weed that, that's massive! Still one around green boxes. Aaron takes him down. Thwaifo's still alive, and he's able to take down one and a whole lot of damage onto another. U-Haul control is taken up. Pure taken back to Zachary now. In a 1v4, only able to take with a panoramic view, and Zachary walks right into him and takes him out immediately. Phase now off the post plant with a man advantage. Player wrapping towards elbow. I mean, he's we did might try and set up a paranoia here. There are three players lined up in tin Absolutely. can that he could get full no, blinded we here. Did. But the smoke, he's gonna try and set one up. He, wants, up. he needs to block all of these extremities off, right? He can't get peeked out from long and pure. I think that was through the box. There Gets a is. huge one. There's a swing back from Aaron, but there is still no paranoia used. It's now down to just two as they're running into the site. But there is another Hunter Siri. BCJ in the clutch. He's got one, needs a second here. It's six bullets left. He's tapped he's the spike. Sitting. It's sticking all the way. He's gotta get it to have. There's the swing, Ooh. but there's the kill from Rockus. Oh, here we go. Phase now. Second around, you actually do have we did taking one back onto Corey, but this hold, it's lockjaw as Aaron takes one back. Rockus with a frag back onto Pyrrha. Rockus actually going big with a 2k. Does equalize things, but Aaron has to go aggressive into oh. bathrooms. Zachary is there. We did on low HP. Needed the headshot. It's gonna end up working. Here we'll be able to grab that orb for whoa, free. Whoa, That's whoa. not gonna do much. It's baby bait. What is this space that he's been allowed here? Right clicking on in. He had the blade storm from whoa. dying in the last round, but we did. Remaining. It's a solo play what? in one rocket, two kills. That's the second time, Aaron. Gotta punish that one. Ronk is able to find two from it, but phase. 
such a, a mess. But even then, FaZe, they almost went too fast for their own good. What on earth? What? I, 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 oh, with the life oh, blah, 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 blah. I can't speak. What on earth was that? Thwifo lines up three after the dash from Baby Bay? Okay, 1v4 now for Corey. I <laughs> Does it make sense if you're going to try and re-swing it? Ooh. And Marv absolutely shuts down Pure in this round like it did to BCJ. There's an early pick, and the Hunter Suri doesn't get much info. They don't take any space off of it, and now Aaron's going to try and reassess. He's expecting someone to swing off of it. But it's two players here, and Baby Bay might not be expecting Aaron whatsoever. Once more, Zachary's on a lurk. Baby Bay, it's a double swing and one kill for the side of Exit to reset to a 4v4. You talk about ciphers and in interesting positions. This time it's Thwaifo over in bathroom, but that recon bolt. Just him trying to take it away exposes this position. Not only that, but I think he did make a little bit of noise early on too. So now X sets with a three-man rotation back over towards their spawn phase actually with a two-man hole back short. I mean, that's just you, Sully. They have the orbital strike. They can essentially just bide their time and just try to use as many players as possible just as meat shields. But there you go, orbital strike. Going down, not going to be able to get a lot of damage, but no kills. Corey does take one back. Same thing with Zachary. We did with another one. Thwaifo, there you go. Now it's a two on two. That Molly still holding on a whole lot of time. Spam through. We did. He tries to pull an Olaf, but he dies to the Molly anyways. He's going back, Baby Bay. Looking for something. BCJ takes the fight. And oh, Baby Bay can't punish. He ends up whiffing the shot but because of that aggression they can reassess out a hookah here they now need to corner this one opera and it's up to we did to try and get something nothing he can do there it's pure on a late rotation but these players are split they know there's one on the flank and it's one from pure that puts it into two versus two now i know exactly where you are he's got a wrap still has a bit of you tell Info is there. <laughs> Singular knack for Baby Bay. I don't know why he's still holding on to it, but I'll be completely honest. Because you have a man advantage and play the 4v5. Cages go down and Rockus. I don't know if he was spotted just yet. He could get something from this. Maybe a little bit more with eight bullets left. It's the spray. A little bit mishazardous. <laughs> he gets gunned down. We did running on through, but it's exit that bring it back to a 3v3. Okay, a little bit ballsy from Marved. Trying to run through the smoke to try to deny the spike plant, but even oh, that, there was actually two covering up that area. 25 HP for Baby Bay, but he's still going massive. He makes that HP matter, and now Pure taking back Baby Bay, but he's still low. Speaking of low HP, Guardians and Pure now taking one back, and we five players here. Four taking the TP, two ready for the cross. Aaron's got one. No, it's the white one instead. With two, there's Aaron finally coming into it. Two players left in phase. They've got nothing to show for it. Oh, BCJ needs to keep that clean, and there you go. It will be revealed by a recon bolt coming in from the Owl Drone and nearly gets Whoa. exposed because of it. He does blast back it away, but he was caught by a paranoia, so that was a hard escape for him. Yeah, no, that was tough. Good combo, though. Well timed. Aaron covering up Hookah, but he's actually backed off. They're going to let go control of Hookah. Now, two players back towards the back two. Should be making their way in through CT spawn, but even then, just trying to throw out as much information as possible. Three Molly. players around the tin can. That Molly oh, could do so Molly. much, and it does. One player has to swing. It's we did just watching the angle no drop way. down from Marv. Oh, I was about to say air gap though. That's where the sheriff starts to struggle. But 45 or 40 seconds left. Apologies, and they need to clear angles. Corey. Catching Aaron with his back turn. Where's the trade? BCJ 1v3. And he's being caught, but he's actually doing some damage here. He gets the kill onto Corey. He's got a real chance of winning this now. I don't think I trust your statistics or your inclinations on whether or not someone can win <laughs> an interaction, but you know, I'll trust you for now because now with 14 seconds oh, left, he oh, does oh, have oh. the angle. For the plant, the showstopper is almost literally just coverage, and there you go. BCJ still gets the kill back, but Corey from beyond the grave 
takes him down with a showstopper but well that's a whole lot of damage to the economy of phase though i mean uh, although we were talking about uh, a couple of knives there makes his way over and baby bay getting pinged he is away could potentially watch the angle nobody swinging on but there it is Ooh. baby bay with a quick show but bcj what on earth was that trade he gets it back but Corey in the back gets one actually you got two coming in from the heaven area x set Restricted now to a man disadvantage, but the Hunter's Theory is going to take it back. Equalized. Not only that, but BCJ takes it from a disadvantage to an advantage just with one ulti. Rock is now 1v2 in such a roller coaster round. Has to do it all. That, that recon bolt is taking so much time off the clock, but again, because of how elaborate this position could be definitely be popping out at any moment so they still have to maintain this control of the u-haul area and oh, oh they, they spotted spot his back he's done he is so done he's still watching around gonna ping not even just trying to go for the funeral theft you still had you still had a tp in the back but that couldn't have been set and phase lay in wake oh aaron yet oh, no. again two rounds in a row Uses his satchel to get himself two frags, but now with three players remaining for phase, they have to face on the information that they had just lost. Three players laying around. There's one in elbow, but still the recons aren't going to go big, but Baby Bay! No! That could just open up the entire round. Zachary! He was all the way in the back line. He still ended up getting that kill. They know That's two plays huge to clear up sights. Rockus. Still laying around. There's two players over towards the long area. TP from we did. But it's a fake one. But it doesn't matter.